Hi everyone, welcome to Caroline's Craft Tree. Today I just want to show you a journal that I made using my digital kit called Royal Azure. I had somebody request a blue journal and I didn't have a blue kit so I made this kit up and I've made this journal out of it. Hopefully she likes it. If she doesn't like it then it will be posted in my Etsy store eventually. Um, but I will update any information below on whether it is sold or in my Etsy store. So there's a bead dangle which I made. On the front I've got two of the butterflies in the kit and I just put some beads down for the body. This is part of an envelope from the kit which I just cut out and I did some stitching around it by hand with a metallic thread couple of the flowers. The flowers have French knots in the middle. I'm not sure how well you can see those on camera. Um, lace across the spine. On the edging I've got some lace and then I did my blanket stitch beading along the side or along the end and I just love how that looks on the end of the journal. I think it looks just fabulous. And the back is just plain. Um, closure is just some seam binding. The tassel can come off if you want. It's just hooked on with a lapstick cloth. So on the inside cover, we have my business cards with a bow paper clip. And then there is a file folder that comes in the kit. And inside... There is an envelope from the kit that has nothing in it. And then this was just some scrapbook paper that I had, which I thought went really well with it and just made a little booklet out of it. This pocket is from the kit, and then I put some vellum on the top of it. And I put some washi tape down either side. Just lace. And this lace was just white, and then I colored it with ink. So one of the pages from the kit, and this is a bag from the kit, and inside I made a tag just using some scrapbook paper, some odds and ends, and a few of the um, things from the kit, the little cutouts. So a nice lined paper from the kit. These are both pages from the kit. This I made into a big pocket. I hand-stitched along the edge. And inside is just a whole bunch of journaling space. All the pages in here are from the kit. There's some of the bead stitching. that I really like how that comes out. It is time consuming, but I love it. So most of the pages in here are from the kit. I didn't really add anything else. There's some tatting lace. And here is one of the fold-out bookmark belly bands with two paper clip bows, so you could move them anyway. And this opens up, opens up again. I do have a tutorial on how to make these. And inside is just part of a page that's folded for extra journaling space. And the, the paper clips do hold this down. And here is one of the envelopes from the kit. And inside is just a couple of the journaling cards cut down so they fit in the envelope. And then the pages. And here is another envelope. This is just a single page just for extra journaling spot. down here this is a big paper clip and inside this pocket i have a franken tag which i made and then these are the four little envelopes that are in the kit they're little they don't have nothing in them so but they're cute
Moonlit beading. Here is another belly band. This butterfly made into a paper clip. And again, that opens up. Did some stenciling side, just some extra journaling space. A couple stenciled words inside there. And then an envelope from the kit. And again, just a couple of the journaling cards in there. I actually really like this kit. It turned out really nice. Lots of line paging. And again, another, just one of the pages in the kit that I made into a folder to slip in the big pocket. And here is another paperclip bow and another large tag made with some scrapbook paper and some of the pieces from the kit, the other bag that comes in the kit. And on the back there is another paperclip bow, an envelope from the kit, and then the other file folder that comes with the kit and inside is just some scrapbook paper made into a little booklet. Again, I just cut out one of the pieces of the page, covered it with a vellum, got the washi tape going up the side. So I hope she likes this journal. As I says, I will leave some updated information once I know if she would like it or not. And I appreciate you watching and hit that subscribe button. Thanks. Bye for now.